Assuming I have ESA installed, I'm going to click that. And that loads ESA Product Manager. Here we have a quick start guide. I'm going to go there. Now we have two different types of users. We have free users and their workflow. We have paid users and their workflow. We also have for paid users manual run, import and sync, and technical support. Now if I choose to run a free import, I'm going to go ahead and do that. And it asks me to set up my eBay account or accounts. We can have multiple accounts. I'm going to choose one, proceed to eBay. And here I sign into eBay and I authorize account access. Once that's done, the import will begin because this is a free import. So now I've imported two products from that eBay account into my Shopify store. I go back over to the store and I look at products. I have two products. You can see the title, the pictures come in, different fields that are imported here, weight. We also handle variations. You see under the variations, we also bring in the price and the SKU. All right, now I'm gonna delete these products and go back and run a paid import. So we're back here again, I've deleted the products and now for the paid system. The paid system has many components, but for paid customers under auto run, I can schedule my synchronizations if I'm a paid customer. Uh, different options for removing items, inventory management, large size images, synchronized prices, etc.